I want to show you guys real quick how to put a frequency into the Baofeng UV5R. Uh, this orange button here goes between the VFO and the memory. So when you hit this, channel mode. when it says channel mode, that means you're in, mem in memory here. See? Frequency mode. Frequency mode means you're in the VFO. I want to delete uh, the last frequency I put in here because these radios usually come with frequencies that you may not want in there so you want to delete them out of there before you start putting it you know programming it manually so I'm gonna delete channel mode. in channel mode I'm gonna delete number 35 and everything is done from the menu so it's very simple people say these radios are complicated they're really very simple so I want to delete menu memory number 35. So what I'm going to do is hit the mem menu button. Menu. And I'm going to go to menu number 20. You see the memory uh, menu button? Number 28. I'm going to hit the menu button again. Delete channel. So it confirmed it, okay? So I hit push the talk and uh, hit the back three. So I deleted memory number 35, okay? Now I want to put a frequency into memory number 35. So every time I key up, the camera goes black here, so bear with me. It's the RF, uh, I'm in a closed confinement here. So the RF is actually. Uh, blacking the camera out but anyway now we're gonna go back into VFO and we're gonna start from scratch alright back frequency in the mode. frequency mode is in VFO I want to punch a repeater in four four seven eight seven five is the repeater I want okay now I need a PL of 156 I gotta go into the memory in, uh, into the menu now press in menu right here menu and I want to go down to menu number 13 you see the number the small little number here you gotta work fast because it'll jump right back out of men uh, out of men at a menu memory number 13 number 13 hit the menu button again to bring that arrow down to where the PL is and I want a 156 PL. I got to bring the up button. Hit the up button. Hit the menu button again to confirm it. Confirm. All right, confirmed. All right. Now I want to go to menu number. Uh, let's see. I got to put the offset, and for 440. It's a 5 megahertz offset. So that's menu number 26. Okay, see it went out, it went out of menu. Hit the menu button again. Menu. Now we're still at menu number 13. Now we're going up to 26 now. Up to 26. It's very simple. It's all at zero. Hit zero. Uh, all right, I screwed up. I'm still in the menu though, so I want to go back to menu number 26. Like I said, it's very simple. Hit the menu button again to bring the arrow down to the zeros. Offset frequency. See, offset frequency. Zero, zero, 005 we want. Hit the menu button again to save it. Confirm. And it's confirmed, okay? Now we need an offset. And to punch in the offset, we got to go to menu number 25, which is down one. Uh, it went back uh, into a regular mode, so hit the menu button. Menu. Go down to number, number 25. Hit the menu button to bring the arrow down to where it says off. Frequency direction. Hit the up button. Hit the up button. 
until you get the positive or shift or off up 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 we need a negative so we hit the menu button to save that now Okay, so we got the frequency here, and now we want to put that into the memory that we deleted. So in order to do that, we got to store it in the memory, which uh, we have to get into menu number 27. So menu. Menu. And we're on 25 now. Up. Number 27. See where it says memory channel? Keep going. We want to keep going up. Hold on a second. It screwed up. Memory channel. Then we bring hit the memory uh, menu button to bring the arrow memory down. Channel. Now go up. I think it was... See how these channels are full? I think it was number 34, was it? 33, 34, number 35, alright? Hit the menu button. Receiving memory. So it, it put that in there. So let's see. Okay, now I'll tap this VFO button, which will bring me back into the memory. Channel mode. Alright, so now we're in channel mode. We stored the frequency in channel mode. You see? Okay, now I'm going to put a frequency in, a 2 meter frequency now into memory number 36, alright? Frequency mode. I'm going to put 1, 4, 7, 2, 2, 5. 1, 4, 7, 2, 2, 5. Now we need a PL of 141. Now hit menu button. Menu. Go to menu number 13. Stay in the menu here. Menu number 13. Hit the menu button to bring the arrow down. And now go down. Now hit the menu button to save it. Confirm. Okay. Now I gotta get a shift in here. It's a positive shift. Menu. So I'm going up again. To menu number 25. It's a positive shift. Hit the menu button to bring the arrow down. There you go. Hit the menu button to save it. Okay. Now we have to get the offset. The offset for 2 meters is 600 kilohertz. So we got to change that 5 megahertz offset to. 600 kilohertz. Hit the menu button. Menu. Go up. Hit the menu button. And num mem Offset frequency. At memory, uh, menu number 25. Zero, zero. Zero, 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 six, zero, zero. Hit the menu button to save it. Confirm. At 600 kilohertz. Alright, the repeater's kind of weak from where I'm at, but we got it in there, okay? So now we want to put this 2 meter frequency into the next uh, memory channel, okay? So we got to get into the memory uh, menu again, hit the menu button. Menu. Menu number 27. Menu number 27, I'm going to go up now. I brought the arrow down. We're going to go up to where it's blank. Or you'll see a blank channel. 36, okay? 
hit the menu button. Receiving memo. And there we go. Press the push to talk. Channel mode. Press the v VFO memory button, and we see we put it. We put the frequency in number 36. You hit the down button. We're in memory now. We're in memory now. So we just put this frequency, the two meter frequency, into menu in memory number 36. Hit the down button. Three five. And we see this 440 frequency that we put into menu memory number 35. Okay. It seems a little more complicated than it is. I probably missed a few steps here and there, but that just gives you the basics of uh, how to fast, you know, quickly program. Uh, the Balfong. So hopefully this video helps a little bit. It's I kind of confuse things a little bit like usually, which I usually do. That's my trademark. Confusing, making things harder than they really are.